It's just tailing into the right hander. And it doesn't beat the field. Some good work down on the boundary. Catch it. That's a good shot. What about the placement? He had two men to beat it. Inside that square there. And did it beautifully. That's a nice shot. It's in the gap. Going to take some catching. No, that'll be a boundary. Just too short and too wide from Nathan Lyon to finish the over. 111 gone. Pakistan 292 for four. Yeah, it was nice batting from Shafiq. It was just a bit short and wide. Got back nicely. Placed the ball just wide of cover. Plenty of room out there on the offside and deep point. Couldn't get around to save it. Oh! Well, that swept away nicely and fine. And that'll run away for a boundary as well. Too straight from John Holland. Just a nice paddle sweep. Went away fine down the leg side. Run's starting to flow now, Alan. Yes, so if the flow of runs continues like this, you might as well take the new ball and see if you can take some wickets. Don't worry about uh, what if. That's a very loose delivery, that one. And just uh, paddled away. Very comfortable. Well, he goes big down the ground. It's a lovely shot and goes all the way. 300 up for Pakistan. Magnificent shot from Shafiq. Quick on his feet down the ground and lifting the ball straight back over Nathan Lyon's head. Yes, we're right on cue. Just talking about maybe up in the ante. Why uh, well, it hasn't been done a bit earlier in the day. That's uh, a very good shot. He goes long again down the ground. Whips it over mid-on and that's a nice shot. One bounce for Shafiq. Showing he wants to start getting on with it against the spinners. Again, it was great use of the feet. Skipped down the pitch. Probably wasn't quite to the pitch of the ball, but went through it anyway. Against the spin, but the timing was excellent. Yes, and the scoring rate has lifted, there's no doubt, so... Yeah, nicely played again from Shafiq. Should get a couple. Well, nicely played. Great use of the feet once again. Placed it to perfection. That'll be another boundary. Well, this is one serious shot, this. Talk about the, the use of the, the feet from Shafiq. He was down the track and just flicking it through that onside. And his field is out in the deep everywhere, but uh, he's picked the gap beautifully. Yeah, the placement was perfect. In particular, or down the track again, this time inside out over cover. That is quality batting. It's toying with John Holland now. That is such a good shot. And just at the point of hitting the ball, I think he slips or he's back foot. Not in the front foot, but just uh, in the end, played an absolute ripper. Because Australia's got a long on and a long off, he picked his spot to, to give himself room, I guess, so he could get the ball over cover. Move forward with it. That's a back foot drive and put away for four and gets a 50 as well. Asad Shafiq has played beautifully. He was dull and dreary early on in his knock, a lot of dots, but he blossomed the moment the spinners came on to bowl and he's flourished. 21st Test Match 50 for a very, very dependable middle-order batsman, Asad Shafiq. And came off a back foot drive, completely in control. A lovely way to bring up your 15. So, uh, off to a very good start in this series, Asad. Oh, pulled away nicely in front of square. Should be cut off in the deep by Peter Siddle. through Nathan Lyon on a pitch like this. And, well, they played him beautifully. Just like that, through the offside against the spin. Big chase for Mitchell Marsh. And they picked the third run on the throw.
Yes, good batting. The, the margin of error is slight. Particularly if you drag the ball down as an off spinner. Only three men patrolling that region of the ground. So just pick the gap and it runs away. Big long chase for Mitchell Marsh. Yeah. That's through the gap. Just a fraction too wide from John Holland. And that is the 400 up for Pakistan. Yeah, just a touch short from John Holland and a little bit wide. The placement was excellent again. Shafiq moves smoothly onto 72. He gets nice and deep in the crease and just had to get the placement right past Mitchell Stark at backward point. It's been a little bit of turn there. That's probably out of the bowling mark for Holland. And over the top of mid-wicket, that's a good shot against the spin. So Pakistan looking to get the run rate up. Yeah, showing his class now, Shafiq. Ball before, got back and deep and cut the ball. Backward a point this time, skipped down the track, got to the pitch of the ball, flicking it over mid-wicket against the spin, as you mentioned. This is class batting and certainly putting a lot of pressure back onto the bowler, John Holland. Get wide of the crease on. That won't turn. And that is into the rope. Yeah, I guess that can be the problem with a inexperienced part-time leg spinner is you're going to get some loose stuff. But uh, that's the 150 partnership between Shafiq and Sahail. Bit of a gift, really. Full toss. Easily put away over mid-wicket. Wicked is at his first. He's done it on debut. He's picked as a batsman and he's picked up a wicket. Great bowling, great comeback delivery. It's his first test wicket. Absolute beauty turning sharply away from the right hander, Shafiq, and he's so disappointed with himself. He saw a hundred. He's been undone by a beauty from Labashane. Well, what about that? Done into his third over. Holland and also Nathan Lyon have done a lot and bowled a lot of overs, but they haven't done this. A little outside edge. What a good catch that from Tim Payne. Didn't go in cleanly. And the breakthrough for Australia. And what a way to bring it up. Asad Shafiq, wonderful innings though. 80 off 165. Bitterly disappointed. Pakistan sit in a good seat. 410 for five.